on Twitter, on Twitch TV, and in glorious high definition on YouTube, this is Barn in Effect. Hello and welcome to the semi-finals of the Euro 2012 prediction competition videos. Massive thanks to everybody that's taken part and I must give a shout out to Swag Underbeak who got his quarter-final prediction for Portugal vs Czech Republic bang on. Well done sir. At this moment there are several players who are realistically in with a chance to win the Turtle Beach headset so don't stop playing now. If you're just joining then just play for fun. Just a quick recap of the rules. You must get your predictions in the comment section below before kickoff with the result, score and goal scorers. Correct result gets one point. If you get all three correct you get three points. And to help you with your predictions, here's a preview of today's match. And welcome to today's semi-final, Germany versus Italy. Italy have never lost a competitive meeting with Germany, but lower side will look to rewrite the history books when this fixture takes place in the second semi-final in Warsaw. Germany will be looking to reverse the tide of history when they take on the Italians in the second semi-final. Like I said, they've never lost. Italy have never lost to Germany or West Germany in a competitive fixture. It's crazy. They've twice beaten them in semi-finals before, both times at the FIFA World Cup, including the 2006 game when I was uh, Germany's assistant coach. Three times winners, Germany have won all but one of their six UEFA European Championship semi-finals, while Italy, champions in 1968, are still looking for their first semi-final goal at the fourth attempt. Head-to-head, -head, Italy have posted twice as many wins as Germany in their 30 previous encounters, their record reading 1-14, drawn nine, lost seven. Italy's record is even better in competitive meetings with three wins and four draws starting with a nil-nil stalemate at the 1962 World Cup in Chile. Italy and West Germany's 1970 World Cup semi-final was a classic won by the Azzurri 4-3 after extra time. Buffon has conceded just twice in four appearances against Germany while De Rossi scored in Italy's 4-1 friendly win in March 2006. Italy have not lost to Germany since a 2-0 friendly defeat in Zurich in 1995. Germany on a world record 15 match winning streak in competitive fixtures but Italy are unbeaten in 14 UEFA European 2012 games since qualifying began with just four goals conceded. Germany have won five of their six UEFA European Championship semi-finals. Italy have won two of their three past semi-finals. Not, despite not scoring a single goal. Germany have only kept four clean sheets in their last 19 matches at European Championship. Germany have scored at least one goal in each of their last 20 games. The semi-final will be low as 84th as the, uh, the German manager. Germany are massive favourites. They won 10 out of 10 in Group A, becoming only one of five sides to go through a qualifying campaign with a 100% record in the history of the European Championship. They were also the second highest scorers in qualifying, 34 goals in 10 games, only three shy of the Netherlands. Italy have won just one of their last seven games in regulation time, that victory over the Republic of Ireland ended a national record run of six games without a victory in major final tournaments. Italy have never scored an extra time goal in the European Championships in seven attempts. I really don't hold much hope out for the semi-final. Reason is Italy went into semi uh, into our game against England into extra time and they've really basically knackered themselves up and not had much time to recover. Germany will be a little bit fresher, they've rested players against Greece. All I can see is a Germany win. Italy will defend for their lives and Germany will just attack, attack. Basically what Italy did to us when we were trying to hang on. So. All I can see is a Germany win in this game, but like always, get your predictions in the comment section below. After this game, it's the final. 